I am way too excited. I'm filming outside because little Zion is, well, he's supposed to be sleeping. He's not sleeping yet. We'll see what happens because he's currently learning how to crawl. But I got the most exciting mail. I should probably explain. Okay, first of all, I almost didn't record this video because what is in here is from KDP, Amazon's printing company, and they put this bar across the cover that says not for resale. It's not the prettiest thing you've ever seen. It's not the worst, but I thought, why not bring you guys in on my process? So what I do is I order from KDP specifically for proofreading and because they're fast and they're the cheapest option. Um, I'm also going to be printing from Barnes & Noble, which will give me the gorgeous final cover without that bar across it. But I actually still haven't submitted my final file to Barnes & Noble because I also finalized the interior uh, front and back matter for that version, and I wanna make sure that it's completely good to go. Um, this one, all the story is good for proofreading, but the front and back matter, I wanna make a couple tweaks, or I already made them. I just didn't make them before ordering this. And then number two, <laughs> when I order from Barnes & Noble, there is a 99% chance that it will take weeks to get here. <laughs> so anyway, I couldn't wait that long. I was like, I want to see it. I want to know how thick this book is now. It's feeling pretty thick, you guys. Um, let's just do it. Oh my gosh. I haven't felt this excited since I think my debut novel, possibly The Stolen Kingdom as well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is why I'm filming outside because I'm so excited and the neighbors probably think I'm crazy. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay. So Mandy and I knew. I gave her uh, like a general estimate. So the page count is got to be tweaked because I added even more, <laughs> probably like 10 more new pages. So the spine is a little off because of that, but the Barnes Noble one will be perfect. And then I also, like I said, I didn't, oh, oh yeah, that's the old. I was like, that actually looks really good. And I was like, oh yeah, that's the old, um, font that matched the first cover. So Mandy sent me the PNG with this font, the title font. Wow. Okay, so I did cream pages. I told you guys that. I don't know if you can even tell by looking. White versus cream. Because that's the genre standard, I still miss the white pages, but it just looks so good. Oh my gosh. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay, so I'm also finalizing the blurb this week because once it's final, it's final. So I'll be giving Mandy the final, 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 final. And then I have to decide. She put The Stolen Kingdom on the back cover and I'm pretty sure she'd be willing to work with me once all three books are published to change that to this. Did that even make sense? To change the four books in the Stolen Kingdom series to the three books in the Queen's Rise series once they're all published and the covers are revealed. But I just don't know. I don't know. I think I think on that. I just love it. I love the little sparkles. I love that Mandy put the mirror on the spine. It will be centered in the final version. Like I said, I gave her a page count and then I changed it after the fact. <laughs> and that, I just love the font. It reminds me of some of the different like fey book fonts and I really love those because I feel like the djinn are very similar to vampires and fey when it comes to fantasy creatures. There's so many similarities, like they live really long, they're very um, secretive, very poised, trouble with having children, don't usually have that many, little things like that. So anyway, I better get back inside. But if you enjoyed this unboxing and you wanna see the unboxing of the Barnes Noble proof copies, which will be the final final, including the final interior, let me know. And if you want a vlog about proofreading, let me know as well, because that is gonna be my next project. <laughs> ah! Oh, wait, hold up. Before I forget, if you haven't already pre-ordered, this is the pre-order information for the paperback. It's going to be exclusive to Barnes & Noble all the way up until release day, and then it will be wide. There's a car. Awkward. <laughs> and I will link the Barnes & Noble pre-order link below. If you do pre-order, it really helps me out. But more importantly, I have gifts for you. So I will put those on the screen here. Actually, I've only revealed one of them so far, but there will be a bunch of gifts. I will link the pre-order campaign form below so you can go check it out and get your free gifts if you do decide to pre-order one of them. I'm just going to give you a really quick hint. I'm not going to tell you everything, but we have assigned book plates. We're going to have annotated exclusive chapters before the release, reader review stickers, and we're going to have an exclusive exclusive live stream with me on release day. If you're excited about that, comment below and let me know. Otherwise, 
I feel really awkward with cars driving by, so I'm gonna go, and I'll talk to you guys again very soon. Bye.